Alrighty, yeah, I wanted to show you um, kind of the stuff. I think it's, oh, I hope this comes out all right. So, uh, yeah, I'm not, uh, I was saying to Zoe, um, I think the good thing is, is that it's so tiny, it kind of feels uh, almost indestructible. I'm sure it isn't. And I'm putting, and I said to Zoe, it's either, either this thing is going to love me or hate me. Uh, either it's going to love me, um, well, it's either going to hate me because I'm, I'm treating it horribly uh, right off the bat. I'm doing things you should never do with it. Um, I can't, well, it's, a, it's partially because I can't wait for the embossing, uh, any embossing plates. And I want to always try to figure out, um, well, m you know, inexpensive ways to do things. So I was like, screw this. Let's see if I can emboss uh, with just uh, household items around the thing. But obviously I have to clue in about how thick you can get it. Oh my God. I've been ramming things through this God awful thing. It's like, come on, you can do it. You can do it because I don't have um, an adjustable thickness. So the only way I can adjust the thickness obviously is by, you know, uh, like shims with the plates, but nine times out of 10, it's the other way around. I have to try to get rid of. However, I did find out this is supposedly some kind of like plate you can, um, uh, get it to grip, but it all I do now is I've been just uh, doing this. I just stick my foot and just press down. It, it that doesn't help here, like for the thing, but it certainly helps me being able to, um, you know, with my other hand. I'm like, come on, force you force the bloody thing through. What I think is going to end up happening, I can already see the warp. Holy f! Um, it's I'm going to break these things, but such is life. Um, so I, this one I did playground sand and you can, hopefully you can see it. Uh, I think I'm getting some great texture. So this is yet again, just the waterproof, uh, waterproof, the water, uh, watercolor paper and, uh, that I got at the dollar store. And, um, yeah, that's the texture bit. As you can see, um, oh, it looks like I wiped out a lot of its original texture just by, sl uh, yep, I did. Uh, wow. That's impressive. But uh, I like that look. And so you see, I even got the dirt, a bit of the dirt into it from the playground sand. So to me, that almost looks like a um, weathered limestone look. So maybe I could use that for, um, if I wanted to do like city walls for, uh, well, for anything really. And maybe that even looks, uh, a, you know, like maybe, I don't know if I put in bigger chunks, maybe it would look like um, uh, machine gun, like gunfire, like just uh, took chunks out of your Adobe or plaster, uh, whatever thingamajigs. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna go and find some other uh, household items around, like uh, maybe some pasta or something, because that'll just crush uh, through the thing. So that ought to be interesting. Uh, yeah, other things like that. Okay, hope you're having a great Sunday.